most of us, if you're an introvert, especially a high introvert, you probably at one point or another in your life have been shamed for being an introvert. Very often that comes at the end of the wagging finger of an extrovert where they tell us that we need to be more confident or that we need to speak more or that we need to put ourselves out there more or that we need to stop being so shy or whatever it is, right? These judgments that get directed at us for being introverts. And I'll tell you, when I was a a kid, I thought I was disordered. I, I thought I was worse than that. I thought I was broken. And I had people that would tell me that I was broken. I had teachers that would constantly tell me that I was stupid or that I wasn't living up to my potential. So I had all of this evidence that I was broken with this thing they call, like, they like to call ADHD. Well, it wasn't until I was in my 20s and really until I started learning a lot of NLP and hypnotherapy that I started learning that for me at least, that ADHD, it's ADHS. It's, it's a superpower, not a disability. See, what they say is because you think differently, you're disabled, you're broken. But that's not the case. It's because I think differently, I can do things differently. Once I recognized that, once I embraced it, I realized that that the way that I think is a superpower and I love it. Hey, if you like this video, hit that subscribe button. I'm posting NLP and related videos every single day and I know you'll love them. And if you want priority notification every time I post a video, hit that bell button too and keep an eye out for the next video.